parents of severely malnourished children in Haiti have something to be happy about. A new malnourishment therapy called Medica Mamba is saving lives and boosting the local economy at the same time. Currently, at least 120,000 children are severely malnourished in Haiti, about 6% of the child population. With the global food crisis, the situation is likely to get worse. But this three-year-old orphan was lucky. Medica Mamba saved her life even after doctors gave her up for dead. Nicole Etienne is one of the caretakers at the orphanage of Notre Dame. She says the fact that this baby is alive today is nothing short of a miracle. The effect was so fast, everyone at the orphanage was shocked. In one week, she went from death back to life. It's a miracle product. Meds and food for kids. They built a factory here to process local peanuts into peanut butter that is then fortified with protein, vitamins and minerals. It costs about $6 a bag to produce and can treat a child for a week. Workers spend most of their time separating good peanuts from bad. It would be cheaper to use imported peanut butter from the United States, but the project is committed to promoting local agriculture. Random lab tests ensure that Medica Mamba is aflatoxin free. These tests are an important part of keeping the product safe for consumers. The organization is also working with local peanut farmers to improve the quality of their crops. They hope one day to eliminate aflatoxins from Haiti entirely. I don't know if Medica Mamba is the answer, but this model that we're promoting where we go and buy agricultural products from Haitians and use Haitian products to produce Haitian products is part of the answer to the food crisis here in Haiti. It could also be an answer to malnutrition. Nearly all malnourished kids treated with Medica Mamba recover. So for the price of just peanuts, these children are winning the battle against malnutrition.